Let me tell you how it is around here. Long time ago, one of my kids pulled out the chessboard and set up the pieces and challenged me to a game. She looked at me with all sincerity and a smile on her face and said, you're going to let me win, right? I said, little girl, you're about to get taken to school. Let me tell you something, Boris Spassky. If you want to win, you got to beat me. That's what winning is, overcoming your opponent. Now, do you want to grow up with an overinflated sense of how good you are? You're eight years old. You can't even spell humiliated yet. This ain't shoots and ladders, pumpkin. You might be the queen of Candyland, but don't be bringing your sense of entitlement up here into my living room, chica. I'm about to repaint the game room with the blood of your knights and bishops, kid. You better check your mindset before you come in here asking if I'm going to let you win. We don't do participation trophies in this house. If you want to be the best, you got to beat the best. Woo! I'm about to give you a ride on Space Mountain, kid. I'll have you at checkmate in two moves, girly mouth. You best go find Bobby Fisher, because I'm coming at you with a Ponziani opening and a Tory attack. Then I'm going to hit you with a folding chair. I don't care how cute your pigtails are. Mean, isn't it? Well, it's really not. See, our kids don't have to win all the time to feel good about themselves. Stop letting them go through life without learning how to be disappointed. Now, these days, she beats me in chess quite regularly. In fact, all my kids do. And the punks probably cheat. But seriously, they know how to win and lose with grace and dignity. Give your kids a chance. But don't give them everything they think they deserve. Mm. Woo! Love y'all. God bless. Here's a Facebook poke. Better get hit with photo, Gerald.